I am Dr. Suresh Babu, Consultant Neurologist and Epileptologist at Erit Hospital. Today I am talking about how we diagnose epilepsy. Normally in a OPD, we will encounter a people come to us with the loss of consciousness or sudden fall. And in those, it is a very challenging sometimes to know what is epilepsy, what is not a epilepsy, especially someone comes with the first episode. So in those, the history especially given by the bystander is very helpful in the diagnosis of the epilepsy. Without history from the bystander, it is very difficult to come to an appropriate conclusion. Sometimes after knowing that it is an epilepsy, we need some more information to know what variety of epilepsy is it, how long we need to use the medicine, what kind of medications we have to use for this particular epilepsy. For those, we use the two modalities for the differentiation. One is the video EEG and the second one is the MRI brain. Video EEG will help. One is, for example, someone is getting the recurrent episodes, means per day, for example, they are getting more than two or three episodes per day. If we connect the patient in the video EEG lab, we can see what is happening during that episode. At the same time, we can know that what the EEG was showing during that time based on the visualization of the video and the simultaneous EEG recording will help are they really true seizures true means are they coming from the brain or not so that helps in differentiating the what is true what is false so that we can appropriately diagnose the epilepsy and we can choose the appropriate medication MRI will help us is there any abnormality which is responsible for the seizure that also guides us for the appropriate drug what to be taken for that particular patient. Thank you.